Hi everybody, Chris Bryant here. Thanks for joining me for today's CCNA 3-minute tip on a forgotten EIGRP command. And in this particular video, as I get our clock started here, we've been called in by a client to troubleshoot a situation where two routers had an adjacency, now it's gone, and we want to start seeing what the problem is. Well, you know what the first command we're going to run here is show IP EIGRP neighbor. And we don't even have a neighbor, so we know there's an issue right there. So the first thing you would likely want to check is whether or not the router is sending hellos and receiving hellos, because we've been told that the adjacency was in place and now it's gone. The other problem is, though, is that the client's telling us we can't run a debug on this router because it's a production router and they're worried about overloading the router. Okay, that's maybe a valid concern. So we need a way to see if hellos are actually going out and coming in. And again, show IP EIG GRP neighbor. It's got a lot of great information there when you do have an adjacency. But here, as you can see, it's not terribly helpful when you don't have one. It's really just verifying what you already know, that you don't have an adjacency. So there is another show command. Show IP EIG GRP traffic. And what we're concentrating on here really is the top row, the hellos sent and received. But I want to give you a quick CCNP preview. These hellos, updates, queries, replies, and acts that you see, these are the five main EIGRP packet types. But again, the only one we're really concerned about is hellos sent and received. That's the one we want to see regularly increment. So let's go ahead and run it now. I've talked for half a minute or so, and we can see that those hellos and sents are sent and received, that is, are staying the same. That is telling you right there that hellos aren't going out properly and they're not coming in properly. So then you can start to look around a little bit. And while we're at it, what would be a good place to start there? What would be a good thing to do? What, you know, once you check your cabling on your local router, that kind of thing, but what, what's the next show command you might want to run? Show interface, right? Let's take a look at that serial one zero we saw mentioned. Administratively down, everybody. What does that mean? It's like the first thing we learn, right? It means that someone has shut it down. So we will do a no shut, and we'll give that a few seconds to cook, so to speak. We'll see the interface come up. Interface serial one zero change state to up. That means physically we're fine. Then the line protocol comes up. That means logically the interface is fine. And then we see dual EIGRP 100, that adjacency is up. So let's run show IP EIGRP neighbor just to make sure there's the usual info there. And let's run traffic one more time, or actually twice. And you'll notice that the updates moved up a little bit, but the hellos definitely moved up, or incremented, I should say. And you can see they've already incremented again. So we are right on time at three minutes. We have solved that problem, and we have been reminded of a very helpful EIGRP command, show IP EIGRP traffic. Thanks for watching today's three-minute tip. I'm Chris Bryant, and I'll see you tomorrow with a brand new tip here on my YouTube channel. Enjoy your day.